In this tutorial, I want to go over how you calculate the volume of cubes and cuboids. As you can see in the diagram here, we have a cube that has a length of 2 cm and a width of 2 cm on its base. This is the base, and it has a 2 cm height. And the key to um, finding the volume, the yeah. amount of space occupied within this um, shape, is as follows. First you identify what the base is, which is this length and width, and you find the area of that base. Then you take the area of that base and you multiply it by the height. So the key here is to identify the base. There should be two bases and they should be parallel to each other. So there's this one and this one. And then you multiply that area by the distance between the two parallel bases. Um, in this case, we will calculate the length, the area of the base by multiplying the length and the width, and then we'll multiply the height. So in this particular case, the volume is going to be equal to length times width times height, which will be 2 times 2, which is 4 centimeters squared for the area of the base, times the extra 2 centimeters for the height, which gives us a total um, volume of 8 centimeters cubed. And note that the volume is always in the unit that you're dealing with to the power of 3. So this means that there is 8 cubic centimeters of space in this cube. In this cuboid, or rectangular prism as they're sometimes called, we have a length of 2 meters, a width of 2 meters, and this is the base, and here's the other base at the top, and there's 5 meters of height in between. So again, we want to first calculate the area of the um, base, which would be 2 meters by 2 meters, which is going to give us uh, 4 meters um, squared and then we're going to have 5 meters. So in this case we're going to go 2 times 2 which gives us 4 meters squared for the area of the base. Then we're going to multiply that by the height which is 5. So 2 times 2 times 5 equals 20 uh, meters cubed. So this means that there are 20 cubic meters of space occupied in this cube. 